guys welcome back to a brand new video i am doing this video for the second time because i filmed this at the weekend and i was miserable um for no reason just down in the dumps and it really came across on the video so i scrapped it and i thought go away a few days later and try again because i went to home bargains last night with my friend lily so i've got a few things there I've got one thing from amazon and stuff from manchester i'll explain in a minute so i'll show you everything that i got from home bargains first so i've got some Bonotti um bliss bars 99 92 calories per bar i got more bin bags i got the 70 litre ones so hopefully these are the right ones because i keep ending up getting the wrong ones 10 in a pack and they were one pound 49 been selling stuff on vintage recently and i saw these in here you get six in a pack and it's the packages and yeah six a4 mailing bags and they were 59p each so i thought that is brilliant that'll do 12 more items and i've been using like old packaging from studio that was really good to use actually i picked up some cans i always get my cans from home bargains so i got diet coke 49p so i've got two of them i got two dr peppers and they were 49p as well and then i also picked up two vimptos like i really restocked because i don't go very often and they were also 49p each i got shampoo and conditioner I've got the Garnier Ultra Blends, which is the ones that I do get, but these are the Argan Oil, Argan Richness ones. Beauty sponge, so it's a Real Techniques Miracle Air Blend sponge. It's pink. I've never seen a pink one, so I grabbed it, and I've only got the Real um, Beauty Blender and an old orange one, which probably needs throwing out, to be honest, so I did need a new one. This was... 199 and the last thing that i got from home bargains was from the brand t-zone and i've actually been using the t-zone scrub on my face which has worked really well um this is the vitamin c and q quant biogradable glow pads effective skin brightening with vitamin c so i actually was using the primark ones of these but they stopped doing them and i really enjoyed using them use every evening well that's great <laughs> because in the mornings i've been using the body shop um toner just to like do my face in the morning i picked up some ear candles from amazon you get 10 in a pack and i'm sure they were four pound 80 four pound 90 they were all multicolored, um but a friend from work was really interested in doing it so we went half so i got all the better colors because she doesn't care and i'm actually going to do these tonight with lauren she's going to help me and hopefully i'll be able to hear a little bit better because i've always been slightly deaf and these do actually work well i've not used this brand before hopefully tonight they work because i've got a hearing test on Saturday book so the rest of the things i need to show is what i picked up in manchester with amber so i went to lush and i got the flamingo egg bath bomb it smells amazing and it's been in these bags so all of this now smells lovely i made my fir first purchase to river island ended up buying a new bag I didn't need a new bag i honestly didn't but me and amber bought this and then she bought it in a different color they also do this in gray which i loved but i don't need it <laughs> um so yeah got this this is a good size there's no pockets in the inside which we found out after um which is a little bit annoying it does come with a little card holder on the strap will not be used now i think it looks really cheap and tacky to be honest but i do like the big thick label that has river island over it and yeah this was meant to be 32 pound but we got there was an offer where we got a certain amount off so we actually saved six pounds 60 so this was 27 pound 30 and obviously i had to get the matching purse so i picked this up this was meant to be 12 pound and it was 10 pound 20 but yeah it's got a little section for coins open it up cards a bit for id or a photo and then there's two little sections here which is quite good i got some things from the manchester shop and i've realized you can actually buy online so i might do that um i picked myself up a postcard this little plaque that says be kind that was it says on the back assassin bell that was four pounds and then I got myself a key ring, obviously a bee. 
And then the rest of the stuff that I need to show you is actually from H&M. I may add in a try on part. I'm not sure. It depends how confident I'm feeling when I come to edit all of this. So the first thing is this skirt. We definitely got money off. So like I say, I'll put the prices on the screen. But it's this midi skirt with a split up the thigh. Meant to be $17.99. And I got this in a size 14. Because I tried the 12 and 14 on. They were literally the same. They fit the same. So I thought I'd just go with the 14. Because it'll feel more comfortable. So I picked that up. And it's going to be perfect for spring. I grabbed this. I saw this probably February time with Lauren. And I was like no. Saving not spending money i'm saving it all for manchester so it's this dress i have got a dress well two dresses similar to this but they don't have a v-neck scoop it's just straight across um but i think this is their new style they've obviously done the same dress but in different style meant to be 14.99 and it's so floral bright colors perfect spring it's got butterflies perfect for the summer and the next purchase is completely, completely out of my comfort zone, um, but I loved it. And I saw it on Instagram and I screenshot it and was like, when I'm in Manchester, I'm going to try it on. And it is beautiful. It was a little bit more expensive because it's H&M Linen Blend. I got it in a medium and it was meant to be $24.99. But it's this strappy, spaghetti strap dress comes in it's quite structured at the top but stretchy at the back flows out and it's definitely a midi style but i love the colors i think it's beautiful perfect on holiday is the skirt um i really like this i really do and i think i might wear it tomorrow um with a white or black cami top denim jacket and white converses lit is quite high um so i probably when i'm wearing cycling shorts i might have to like pull them up just a little bit i like this this is what it looks on and it's gonna be perfect for spring denim jacket perfect for the summer and yeah i really like it and i feel really comfortable in it um the top bit of my arms is covered it comes in at the waist and then goes out over the stomach area so yeah really love this obviously definitely not with slippers but i just love this dress i really do love it and it, it's a really nice material it's quite thick um i probably wouldn't take it on holiday um because the material is just really thick but it is beautiful let's have a look at the colors um and again it comes in at the waist it's really like i think it fits really well around the chest around the waist and then goes out and flowy i'm not normally a fan of the longer dresses but i really like this and just before putting this on i was like i don't know to return this this is the one item that i'm like hmm Maybe I'll return, but I'm going to wear it. I'm going to keep it and I'm going to force myself to wear it over spring and summer because it's just so, so lovely. But yeah, that is everything that I need to show you. I need to film a massive Primark haul probably tomorrow because Lauren's coming around tonight. So yeah, I'm going to go. I hope you are all okay. And yeah, I'm glad to be back filming. I've got a video going live tonight. I missed Monday's slot. So I need to try and get back to it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe and stick around for more videos. Bye.